Hello everyone, welcome back to Kumayu E Team Official Channel. Today I'm Chui E again and I will show you how to set up a Windows 10 on any uh, relevant uh, generations of Intel CPUs. So uh, now I'm gonna click uh, plug your USB boot about flash drive here and then uh, click the power on and then press the escape to uh, select boot so now I'm gonna start it with that and uh, press escape here and the part below you have to select to enter setups so by using the this key and then hit enter uh, window 10 uh, set up for it it generally happened to the uh, the first generation uh, the, the 11 generation of CPUs so now go to set uh, up first and uh, uh, hit enter and okay now I'm gonna show you what is wrong with that and when you try to uh, clicking on escape mode it will showing you the boot option here and you will see to how to select uh, any boot and now click on enter because uh, we need to boot it from the USB flash drive So, uh, waiting a few seconds. And now we are going to uh, select the language that is uh, called English because we are using an English. And then click next and then click install. The window is setting up now, but it will have a problems in uh, uh, when you set up or you trying to delete any drives on uh, your PC. And here is the problem: so you cannot see any drivers, uh, all kind of drivers that we don't see. Also, although you can use this, while also you still it still cannot help you. Uh, now, gonna you cannot use this while also. So, uh, I will show you how to fix that now. I just want to test it to show you that all although you are using all kind of this. Uh, well, it's still not showing up like this. So, uh, I will show you how to fix that. Now, click on close here and click yes. And click close again and click yes. And then the, fo the PC will be restart and you should be hit the escape mode and go to set up uh, by your setup here. And here is the, the method that you can uh, select all any part of that. So I'm gonna use uh, the boot option here. The step one. Step one is you should select uh, the boot option. Okay, now go ahead and click to the boot option one here and select. Uh, the USB port drive here so click on that and uh, the next is go to the security and, uh, and you will see the checkers boot here so you need to close that um, to disable it click uh, enter and disable that and now uh, click on escape to return and the step 
number three is go to advanced here and then uh, you need to uh, scroll down to find Zata configuration here Zata configuration hit enter and you will uh, see a more hit enters one more enter and you will see these two ties one is Intel SOT premiums with Intel Ops game system so you don't need to choose that if you choose that you will stuck and cannot find any driver after you install the windows so I recommend you to select the first one that's called is HCI <coughs> uh, so uh, select the HCI and uh, hit enter and hit OK and now we have to uh, return it and uh, click to uh, save and exit place uh, save change and exit and hit enter it's the way and say yes ok now waiting to see what happened the next and uh, the flash is uh, connecting now and uh, the boot is starting so uh, this is for the way that it is an other method that can help you to set up uh, window 10 that that is uh, no SSD found in your setup now I'm gonna click on that okay and here is the window you can choose uh, if you want the window dryers or anything and this one or so and click next and loading drivers and now the drivers is already seen here it uh, okay now we have don't need to create any small drive so you need to click next and the driver is already here now it works so thank you for watching my video tutorial if you have any more question about Windows setup so please comment it below my video so thank you for watching it is for the um, Intel 11 generation it always happened like this so thank you for watching